Hello everyone and welcome to Miss Creative 47 YouTube channel. Someone just was asking about taking out Peppy Peppy Pig. I guess that's what he's called, she or whatever. Um these are two different I mean these are images but they on different backgrounds. Sometimes this one people think this transparent but it come in no. I don't know how they did it but they did not create it as transparent. This one has a um background on it where it has images on top of images so let's do this one with the transparent background because i don't know exactly what background you had both of them can be difficult but i will show you how to get rid of them here and i will show you how to go to another website that is awesome for when silhouette just can't do it and i use it often because sometimes silhouette can't do it sometimes i can't figure it out but Either way, I'm going to show you how. So I'm going to start with this one first. I'm going to go over here to the trace button and click on that. Open the trace window, click on trace area, drag my plus sign trace window over. And I'm going to slowly start to click in the box. I never use the arrow because I want to, uh, I want to um, have control over the clicks. And I want to take a look at it and see how it's looking. See, now I click too much. I can just click back a little bit. And now I know that it will come out perfectly. Now, this is going to come out too, but I'll just delete that. So you can do that. Now, sometimes this doesn't work for me. And then that's when I go to the website uh, and uh, use the website to get the uh, background like this out. And then I'll just do trace and detach. and it's removed and I'll just go and drag my arrow oops let me move you out the way drag my arrow and get all the rest of those little things that might show up if I decide to cut this and don't see that all these little things are laying on there it will cut out through my uh, image there and it just be a total mess so now you can see he's perfectly uh, cut out now let's try this other one here I'm going to get my trace window again. It's off to the right. Some may have it at the top, but I am in business edition. But either way, basic designer business, we still have the same icon here. Trace select area. Click. I'm going to drag it over the image and see if I can do the same thing. And see, I'm at 72 already and it covers almost everything. So this one right here, I probably have to go to the website and let them do it. So let me take you there. So I'm going to just minimize this. And here's the website. If you can see it here is www.remove.bg. And this is what it looks like when you uh, come in on the website and you want to say upload image. And I'm going to look for the image right here on my desktop open and it's going to open in another window and it took all that out for me now when it comes to download you're going to have a download preview and you're going to have a download full a download full means that the resolution is much higher and i can make this as big as i want i can even put put this on a backdrop because the the resolution and the clarity of the image will still be intact if i use this and i stretch the image it will start to get blurry so if you want the full uh version of this then you have to subscribe which i subscribe it's like 12 dollars a month but i use it a lot so if you're interested in that then you can use this instead of silhouette when silhouette don't work so i would just go ahead and just download the high resolution because I, I have a subscription but if i didn't i'm just making stickers then if i click download here it'll just go ahead and download that i'll just click off of that and it, it downloaded so all i have to do is just go to one of my files and click on downloads and it's right here i'll just click on that and there it is right there I mean, I know you can't see it, but uh, if I was to take that and let's open silhouette. 
let's get rid of that. If I go and click on a file instead of clicking on merge, go to my downloads and I just drag it over. There it go. The image right there. And if I don't want these right here, all I do is take my eraser and just get rid of those. I'll just go around it to make sure. And there's my image. So that's how you able to do it on Silhouette. And you can also go to the website www.remove.bg and also uh, get your images background taken out. So until then, I'll see you in my next video. I hope this helped. Have a blessed and safe day. And thank you for watching. Bye.